Welcome back to Gardening with Tracy. Today, we're gonna be harvesting some broccoli. I've only planted two plants this year, and one of them I've let go just a little bit further than it should, so I wanted to make sure to show what you do want and what you don't want when you're harvesting your broccoli. So, let's get started with this. First, we're gonna look at what you don't want. I've let this one go too far. Um, as you can see, these heads, the little um, heads are starting to open up. Anytime you see any yellow, you've, you've probably waited a little bit too long. And the fact that these are opening up, they're fixing to start blooming. So I've waited too long. I'm still gonna harvest this. I'm gonna use this tool right here. I'm gonna see if I can cut through this right below right above I'm not gonna say where that other floret is oh yeah so what I've got here I've got this one harvested I can use part of the stalk for vegetable stock or anything if I can't use any of it for broccoli. All right, now, now that we've seen what you don't want, <laughs> let's look at what we do want. This broccoli head here is much better. You can see it's still tight, it's still closed up. I'm gonna do the same thing, I'm gonna go about right there. I'm gonna try not to damage any of the plant. And there we go. And just break these leaves off. A good looking head of broccoli there. One thing I did I came back in here with a sharp knife and I could have done this with my scissors, but um, because they're very sharp, but you want to make sure that you cut this at an angle because keep in mind, you want to let these side shoots start growing and this will uh, allow the water to flow off of that. So you want to make sure to cut it with a very sharp knife or pair of scissors and make sure to cut it at an angle. You can also eat the leaves of the broccoli plants. These are good for wraps. Um, you could put them in a salad if you'd like. Um, really good, you might, you might, you know, like that better than lettuce. Um, it, kind of like kale, or whatnot, but you can also, after we, after we harvest these side shoots, if they produce anything, we will take and just harvest the whole plant. But we're going to try to get as much out of these plants as we can. Now what we're going to do, we're going to just wait and see if these little side shoots are going to produce more broccoli. So we've harvested the broccoli and I wanted to go over one more time. Here's what you got. You don't want it to look like this. You want it to look like this. And even this one, and, and you can see in this one, you've got a really dark tight crown and that's what you're shooting for i almost waited a little bit too long because you can see a little yellowing on the edges but this is what you want to shoot for and just cut it above those side shoots so you can hopefully promote some more growth there but this one has definitely been um uh, it's, it was left on too long so this is not what you want to do um you want to do you want it to look like this Remember, you can use all of the plant. You can use the leaves. Um, even if it flowers, I've read and heard where some people use the flowers in their, in their salads. Well, that was just a quick tip on how you can harvest some broccoli. And um, if you appreciate this video and you want more videos of this type, you can uh, hit that like button and subscribe button below, and I'll get some more videos out to you. This has been Gardening with Tracy. Thanks for watching.